criminals these days. Never let us rest. What do we have this time? Real sicko. He steals rare birds and sells the feathers off of the black market. Got any leads? We've got nothing so far, but we do have a description. He has a blue tattoo across his forehead. Does he have a flight pattern? There's no need for joking around, Hard Ian. No, we don't. I also have Detective Davidson on the case. You two are the best of the best. Just don't let him get under your skin. Are you sure it didn't just fly away? I assure you, Mr. Hardy. Do you I think cameras in here. Well, yes. Nothing. Nothing. So, you're on this case too? Ha! You'd think they'd get someone more qualified than you on this job. What do you want, Jeffrey? Just wondering if you've gotten anywhere on this case. I heard the feathers on that thing go for... I don't have time for this. Just stay out of my way when I find that bird. Let the bird go. I told you, when I find the bird, stay out of my way. The bird is mine, and there's nothing you can do about it. The bird belongs to its rightful owner, Jeffrey. Put the gun down. Don't you see? I needed to get my hands on this bird. There's no other bird like this now. It shouldn't exist, but yet it does. This bird is a ticket to fortunes beyond our imaginations. That's why you need to get out of my way. A rare red pigeon was recovered and returned to its owner last night after a standoff between detectives John Hardy and Jeffrey Davidson. Jeffrey was then admitted to Oakwood Penitentiary, facing three counts of murder. The GCPD gave a statement yesterday. Thank you, Detective Harvey, for making the city just a little safer. <laughs>